Hey guys, it's Debbie. Welcome back to my YouTube channel where we speak like speak what you seek until you see what you said. Now I know, I know, I know, I know it's been quite a while since I've done one of these videos. No excuses, but let me tell you, I finally got my home. I've been in the military, I'm back. And I told you when I come back, I'm gonna come back better than ever. I have most of my clothes here from back in Maryland. Again, I'm in Kansas right now. That's where I'm stationed. And we're just gonna make do with what we have. I got my own home, so of course right now I don't really have a setup. I am currently holding my camera with a camera stick. <laughs> so just give me a little bit more time to make this room my YouTube room, basically. Uh, my closet is actually right over there. And I have a huge mirror now. Now it doesn't look that big, but it is Huge. I got it for $23 at Salvation Army, so that is amazing. So I upgraded mirrors just for you guys. And yeah, it's just been a pretty busy, pretty hectic, uh, of course. Girls getting married soon in December um, with Nathan. That's a separate video, so if you want to see that, go ahead and comment down below. Uh, and other than that, I hope you guys enjoy this video. And again, I'm so sorry for just putting this off I just know that this needs to be priority I asked you guys on my Instagram and if you're not following me on my Instagram it's speak underscore life with three E's what you guys wanted to see and it was a resounding yes for fall lookbooks now I am so happy it's October and you guys have been asking me uh, since I've left to Romania to do these so today is the day now without further ado let's get into the fall modest lookbook so the first outfit I have here, obviously you cannot go wrong with a black turtleneck. Now this black turtleneck is a little bit looser than others that you would wear under a dress. But I absolutely love it, it's super comfortable and I don't know, ever since I went to Romania, the culture of flannels just hit me like a truck. I love flannels now, I wear them almost every time. You'll see one in this video but I'll have a couple later. Um, because this is not the last video I'm going to be making. Uh, but I love the blue and the black. It kind of just goes well together. And the skirt that I'm wearing is a soft gray skirt. Super comfy. I think it just all ties together. And of course, the shoes that I'm wearing are these old Converse. Now, I added socks to them just because I thought it added a little bit more style into the outfit. You can choose to wear them, you can choose not to. I chose to wear them because I think it just ties the whole outfit together. But basically, this is the first outfit. Now, the second outfit is pretty basic. It is just a tan dress that I got actually for $4 here at Kansas. Um, it has pockets. And over it, I am wearing my Sherpa jean jacket. Uh, again, it just gives me that fall vibe, especially the color. It's like a uh, dirty mustard, I guess you could say. And the shoes that I'm wearing it with are these white Nike shoes. And it goes well together because around the rim of the shoe, it has the same color as the dress. So, of course, I was like, yes, we are going to wear this. But this is the second outfit. The third outfit is this blue knitted dress it is super comfortable let me tell you guys and it is so warm as well for these breezes that we're gonna get for the fall and the color of it is just amazing I don't know it's like a teal blue green I don't know but I think I'm vibing with it and then of course with the shoes I'm wearing these Sperry's now in the fall it is not too cold not too hot so of course I'm gonna whip out my Sperry's cut it because I think it goes well with it but if you have boots any tan boots um, or any other boots that you think would go well with these type of dresses, feel free to wear them, of course. This is the third outfit. Now the fourth outfit that I'm wearing, it is a regular black skirt with a regular green um, t-shirt. And to spice it a little bit more, I added this light blue jean jacket over it just to give it that uh, chill fall vibe. I would definitely wear this going out with friends or if we're just doing some kind of like late night bonfire and it's not too cold, I would wear stockings with these or even like those light uh, see-through stockings. And the shoes that I'm wearing with this outfit are my favorite Doc Martens. I love these shoes. If you, go, if you guys do not have a pair of these Doc Martens, I highly suggest you get them because they go good with everything, I'm telling you. And this is the fourth outfit. 
Now the fifth outfit is pretty basic, but again, when we're dealing with the fall, it is not too cold, not too hot. So I am just wearing this black turtleneck shirt with this awesome jean skirt that I got in Romania. It is a two pattern skirt. You have a light side and a dark side, and I love the slit right in the middle. It just gives a little bit more spice. So if you are wearing just a regular black top, I highly suggest you just go out with the bottoms, whatever you have that you feel like will shine bright and you wanna go ahead and show it off. These are my go-to. Now those were my five outfits that I had for today's modest lookbook. I plan to make these videos twice a week and I'm gonna try to split them, meaning casual fall winter outfits and then the next ones will be my fall church outfits. I'm currently going to church down in Salina. It's about an hour away from the base and I absolutely love it. Um, Nathan and I went to go visit it when we first got here after leave and I believe that was uh, the beginning of August and we've been there ever since. The pastor's amazing, the congregation's amazing and it's just a great vibe to be into and I hope to vlog uh, that church here soon but we're still getting a little bit comfortable, you know how that is. But I hope you guys appreciate these outfits. I hope you guys can use this, take ideas and go into your closet and figure out exactly what you think your style might be. This is just mine. Again, if you have not yet, subscribe to my YouTube channel, give this video a big thumbs up and go ahead and comment if you like this video and want more. I hope you guys are doing great. As always, I'm praying for each and every one of you and I'm thankful for everyone's support. And I hope to see you guys soon in my next video. God bless.